Hey guys, how's it going? It's Bill Moore back again with another hot and spicy product review for you guys. Now, I'm really excited about this one because I'm going to talk about um, all of these products on this one review for this uh, new company that is located up in Meredith, uh, New Hampshire by the name of Mola Foods. Now, these products were sent to me uh, from the owner, uh, Jeanette Bryant, and uh, I'm going to be reviewing uh, several of their chili relishes. Uh, from Mola Foods. Here's one. This is the uh, the green one, and also going to be uh, talking about the their orange chili relish, and they also have a little bit of a hotter one. This is their red uh, chili relish from Mola Foods. So let me go ahead and uh, talk a little bit about them. I want to share their story. Uh, it says, "I have a good friend of mine I grew up with in Cameroon. One day he told me he always wanted to make." create a chili sauce company with the chili grown from Cameroon and prepare the sauce exactly as we do in Cameroon. Now what makes these chili relishes so unique uh, is that they are made with the Cameroonian uh, ghost pepper. I believe it is similar. It's not the same as the uh, the Butchalokia from India, but uh, that's what they call it. Uh, it grows there in Cameroon. Uh, there in Africa and it really has a unique taste and uh, is quite hot as well. It says, uh, however, we did not know how to do it so he asked me if I was interested in doing something like that. I had the recipes ever since I could remember but never thought of doing anything than just cooking for myself and my family. Then it hit me that I could actually do it so I started working on refining the recipes based on people's feedback and today here I am doing business with my best friend uh, chef uh, Tiffany Henderson and I'm eager to receive more um, feedback from people's reaction to the relishes. Now it's very interesting uh, the name of this company uh, Mola Foods actually uh, expresses their values. Uh, it says we can sum up our Mola values as follows M Meet the client's demand with the best uh, possible chili product. O, offer a higher standard product uh, to clients by always focusing on a moral code that requires one to provide a great product with great value. L, learn the needs of our clients by stay, staying open to their taste and adjusting our new products based on customers' feedback. And A, aspire to always provide a quality product over quantity, building trust with our customers and creating open lines of communication and accountability to better our product. All right, that is awesome. Now let me uh, uh, share what it says on the side here. These uh, recipes were handed down uh, from generations, from mother to daughter, and actually uh, uh, Jeanette's aunt um, shared the recipes with her, and uh, that's how she brought these to market. But on the side here it says, uh, Mola Foods uses authentic ancient African tribal recipes that have survived by being passed from mother to daughter using ingredients from specific regions of the central West African rainforest. Our products are deliberately flavorsome with undeniable freshness. All right, well, let's talk about each of these. Um, I'm just amazed at the flavor on these. Uh, I love products like this, something different. Now, this is a chili relish. Uh, starting off with their green one, their uh, ingredients are garlic, lemon juice, green chilies, uh, sweet bell peppers, white vinegar, onions, sunflower oil, and salt. And uh, this is their best seller, the green one. This is what it looks like. I'll show you the consistency on it. Uh, I think this is probably the, uh, the mildest of all of them. But just take a look at that. I love uh, the consistency on this one. All right, let me go ahead and give a little taste test on this one. Mm. Wow. Oh, just amazing. Now this one, the green one, definitely comes off, to me, definitely garlic forward. Um, it's This is the only one of the three that's got vinegar in it. So you get a little bit more tartness, you get a little more sweetness, you know, coming from the sweet bell peppers, but definitely garlic forward and just, just an awesome flavor on this one. Now, the second one here is their orange one, and I think this one, uh, it comes across as being onion forward, and that's exactly the first ingredient. We have onions, lemon juice, 
red and green chilies, shallots, sunflower oil, ginger, salt, and white pepper. Now this one, when you smell this one, definitely onion forward on this one, unlike the green one, which was more garlic forward. But you've got your same <clears throat> basic consistency, as you can see there. All right, do a little taste test on this one. Mm. Now, definitely onion forward, a little bit hotter, but just an awesome flavor. I believe I can pick up on that ginger as well. This one is very, very savory. Um, definitely you get the onions because they're, they're uh, the first ingredient. It doesn't have the vinegar in it, so it's a little bit less tart, but just amazing, amazing, amazing. Great stuff. Now, if you really want the hottest one and you want something that's more pepper forward, then definitely uh, this is what you get with the red one. Here's the ingredients on this one. We start off with lemon juice, onions, red chilies, shallots, sunflower oil, and salt. Yeah, definitely you get the uh, peppers more on this one. Wow, my mouth's burning a little bit already. Now it's really going to burn from this one. Check out that. Doesn't that look beautiful? All right, let me go ahead and do a little bit of this one. Mm. Wow, love the flavor on this, guys. Just awesome. Definitely on this one. Um, less sweet than the other two. Definitely chili pepper forward. There's no garlic in this one, um, but just a lot more flavor of those chili peppers. So just amazing products. And this uh, other product that they have here that is just uh, fantastic as well is their all-purpose seasoning. Check this out. As you can see, just a really nice looking uh, seasoning. Now here's the ingredients on this one. Um, granulated garlic, salt, granulated onion, black pepper, cayenne, ginger, paprika, turmeric, and white pepper. And the salt on this one, sodium is very low, only 35 milligrams. That's another awesome thing about it, is having an all-purpose seasoning that is just not overloaded with too much sodium. Very, very tasty. Now, let me show you some pictures, guys. The first thing I did uh, when I checked out these uh, the chili relishes, uh, I had some Peruvian roasted chicken. There's a picture of it right there. Um, and I topped it with the red one, and it was amazing. So these relishes are just good for grilled meats. I think they'd just be fantastic on many different types of food. And another thing that I did is I um, what's very popular in Cameroon is what they call a spaghetti omelet. You know, just using leftover spaghetti, uh, maybe some uh, vegetables in there, some uh, onions. I also put uh, shallots. Here's a picture of that. And then topped it with the green sauce. And also used the all-purpose seasoning in that as well when I was beating up the eggs. But just amazing. These products are highly recommended, guys. Uh, just check them out. Um, if you're looking for something different, um, these are highly recommended. Flavor, 10 out of 10 uh, for all of these products. Uh, the heat level, I would say, uh, on the uh, green the green relish here, I would give that probably about a 3 uh, out of 10 for heat. And the other two, um, probably a 4 out of 10 for the orange and uh, the hottest one here, the red, definitely 5 out of 10 for heat on this one. Nice medium burn. Probably a whole lot hotter uh, for a non-chili head. But just some amazing products. All highly recommended. Check them out at molafood.com. Uh, Link will be down in the description. And uh, give them a like on Facebook as well. Uh, Chef Tiffany and Jeanette, thank you so much for sending the products. I really do appreciate it. And guys, thanks so much for watching. Stay tuned for a lot more, and until the next time, make sure you enjoy the burn. We'll see you guys later.